Welcome back everyone. This is another episode of Minecraft Mod Sauce with John, Michael, and Marina. And we're here today uh, just finishing up a little bit of the bot, uh, Botania uh, crafting. Last episode we did the basic uh, Botania getting started. And today I just want to cover some uh, uh, smaller aspects of it. And um, my goal for today is to take a whole stack of leather, I'm sorry, a whole stack of rotten flesh and turn it into leather. Because I really want to get a hang glider to cruise around in our, our new area here. So without further ado, we will get started with the Botania uh, creation of the uh, Alchemy Catalyst is what we need. So that is made by Living Rock, Gold Ingots, a Mana Pearl, which is an Ender Pearl that's put in the Mana Pool, and two Brewing Stands. And now you'll find out that the last episode, or two episodes ago, uh, we went to the nether to get blaze rods and this is why we needed the blaze rods. So we just need cobble and blaze rods to make the brewing stand and let's get started. So cobble and we need two of those and a blaze rod, blaze rod and we need two brewing stands. And we needed two, and we should be good there. I got the Ender Pearl to make that, and the Living Rock is over back at the Botania stuff. It's nighttime. Let's quickly rest. Start a good Botania day with early morning. Okay, so let's get going. So, first things first, I'll show you some work I did after the Botania episode last. I made a bunch more of my day blooms. And those are here. And if you hold the wand down, these are all getting drained by the mana spreader. Mana spreader is getting a fair amount of mana. You can see the mana build up there and it's sending it as quickly as it can. And you can see the mana that's in the mana pool. I upgraded the mana pool from a diluted mana pool to a mana pool by just taking uh, the mana pool and the diluted mana pool and putting it in another diluted mana pool and it will create a mana pool if there's enough mana in there. So right now I need the living rock, I need my ender pearl, and then if I hold this over there, I, it's, this tells me that I'm going to convert my ender pearl to a mana pearl, and the check mark there tells me that I have enough mana to do so. So now if I hit Q, I get back the mana pearl. That was my one and only ender pearl for right now, but I will sacrifice that to get my leather. And that should be good. Okay, so what it's hard to understand how to use this. What you need to do is put this um, alchemy catalyst underneath your mana pool and it'll change the shape of this. So right now it just looks like stone there. If I go under this and I place it there, you see I get a different texture of the alchemy catalyst that's now there. So now I there's lots of things that I can do. I can turn cobble into sand, which is very good. I can also take uh, rotten flesh and convert it into leather. So we're going to go over here. My son Michael had a chest here with a 
bunch of rotten flesh. So we're going to hopefully convert most, if not all of this, to leather. So basically, you just take what you're looking at and hold it over there and it says it has enough to do that. So I'm going to throw the entire stack here. Control Q will throw the entire stack there. And it only had enough mana, you see, to convert six. So I need to let that cook for a little while and build up mana. So the process is still the same. I just need a bigger, a bigger reserve of mana. So in the future episodes, we'll get other flowers that are able to um, generate more mana and uh, to let the pool build up between episodes and so forth. So as of right now, we have enough to uh, leather. more so every every uh, so s few every 10 15 seconds we're able to do another leather so we'll let that cook for a little while so that's basically what I wanted to do for this episode is to just get the um, the way to turn cobble into sand and So that was able to do 13 sand, uh, and I'll be able to convert cobble to sand and the rotten leather, rotten flesh into leather. So I will have my hang glider in the next day or two. So that's it for this episode. I want to next episode do some thermal expansion, get my pulverizer going, get some machines going, so that we can start uh, making some advanced gear. We have our, our portal to the nether that was done last episode, and uh, we found a stronghold where we can camp out some blazes and get some blaze rods, and that's about it for right now. Thank you. Have a good day.